catch them up. <laughs> I spilled all over my fucking screen. I know you did. <laughs> At all. I swear to God, I am dyslexic. It just, it is, it's, it's fun. I don't know if that's not blunt. I hit earlier that fucking habitch tea you just gave me. You can't get that deep in five minutes? Fuck it. <laughs> it depends on the crime. She's actually got to slick read that shit over because I'm dyslexic. <laughs> Y'all don't think I got it. I got it. You sneaky motherfucker, boy. I'm making sure we both understand. They stab you in the back, <laughs> huh? Four years? You really don't care. I'm gonna fuck. Cause I, <laughs> the pit, look, 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 look. Woo, that's a good one. Get on. Oh, shit. The dragon will be kitty. Lucky cat. What tastes like? Hmm? I don't know yet. I haven't tasted it. It's a biscuit. Why did you do that? It smelled like uh, raspberry. I see that. <laughs> I'm not really big fan of raspberry. It's just the way you jump back, like it's poisoning you. It's like a tingle. It's a tingle in my nostrils. I don't think it tastes like raspberry though. What tastes like? But it, it kind of tastes like fruit juice to me. To me. Is raspberry not fruit? You know the fruit juice that just say fruit juice, and it could just be any fruit. Are you talking about red drink? Yeah. Yeah, I'm a fan of that red drink. Mm -hmm. I don't know about that purple drink. Maybe on the weekends, I'm going to get a little loose. All right, <laughs> hi, I'm Davis One, <laughs> and this is how did what how did you know your name? I call you Tim. <laughs> so you just want to introduce me as Tim? No, you're going to introduce your YouTube name. Well, my YouTube name is Elisa Veda. Elisa Veda. I can't spell that, but I pronounce <laughs> it right. Or just Lisa. All right. So what we're doing right now is uh, we're going to go through a list of 100 questions. We're not probably not going to do the 100 questions. Definitely not. But <laughs> we're going to go through the list. And what we're going to do uh, is 100 would you rather questions. And we're going to pass off the laptop or the questions to each other each time. So. You go first. All right. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> Let me looky look. Oh, I can't see it. No. 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 <laughs> it's one of the game. It's a game now. <laughs> uh. Okay, I got one. I got one. Would you rather get rich through hard work or through winning the lottery? I feel like I'll get dressed for this, the lottery. Why? Because I'm, I'm tired of working. <laughs> I'm 27. I'm already tired of working. Listen, <laughs> ain't nothing wrong with some good hard work. <laughs> I want that easy motherfucking money. I'm picking the lottery too. Exactly. Goddamn. But you got to like, if you think about it, like you ever seen them things on like TLC or like Lifetime or fucking E when they be like, oh, you win the lottery and then, you know, lottery, uh, bad luck or some shit like that. Like. Uh, the lottery Wait, curse. I, have... I think it's the lottery curse. Wait, okay. Which curse? Is it the one where like people come after you and try to kill you, or because <laughs> that's a thing? I'm not. I'm just saying that follow <laughs> under the same fucking umbrella. I okay. Think. So like, I think it's just like once you get a large sum of money, like bad shit start happening. You know what I'm saying? Or you just make stupid decisions. That's really what it is. They make that's really, really dumb what decisions. it is. I think one lady like she won like. Some amount of millions of dollars, and she like bonded her husband out. <laughs> uh, then she bought like I don't know, she bought like a lot of housing. Then she, got, I think she got caught up scamming or some shit. Don't Why quote would you me. Scam? Don't quote me on that. I don't know. I was just rambling. Okay, fuck that. Um, so we're on a consensus. I apologize, lady, if you're watching this and um, that offended you. <laughs> you did some fucked up shit though. You could have been still rich. Now you're living in projects. Here you go. Why she gotta be in the projects? She's probably in jail if she was scamming. Uh, I wish the projects on before I was in jail. I thought your shit was touch screen. It okay. <laughs> Confession. I didn't get the upgraded model. You know what I'm saying? I got the cheapo. Ain't nobody mad at you. It was two thirty nine, and uh, the touch screen was like four or something. So two thirty nine. I'm gonna try, try some of your bitch tea. You better not talk shit. What? I feel like you gonna talk shit. You don't know yet. It smells like a fucking candle. <laughs> <laughs> I 
You want to talk shit, don't you? Is it good? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what does it taste like? I'm guessing it don't taste like fruit juice. You ever walked into like one of those like uh, a rob stores with the scented candles and all that <laughs> shit? It smells like the incense. It smells like some juice. <clears throat> you ever tasted what you can smell before? So it tastes like an incense. It tastes like. It tastes like Rashid. Was that you telling me what it tastes like? No, nigga. That shit made my nose itch. That shit tastes like Rashid's house. Question. Mm -hmm. Would you rather go deep sea diving or bungee jumping? Shoo, I'm black. (laughs) Aww. I can't swim. I'm not going to lie. I got my answer. The fuck you mean? I already know. I would rather bungee jump. Oh, you asked yourself the question. I thought we both answered. Oh, okay. Um... Give me a second. Okay, take your time. Bungee jumping as in like with a cord, right? Yeah, that's and the you... bungee jumping. Uh, uh. Mm-hmm. <sighs> and then deep sea diving is deep. Damn. Like I think that's the one where you have the thing on your back. <laughs> For real, my heart started being out the either one of them. I know, like, right? <laughs> with the flippers and I'll take my chances in the lake in in the sea. Seriously? Yeah, I definitely take my chances in the sea. Man, bungee jumping is like one and done. Like, you jump No, it's not. Dive. Do you know how you long jump, they deep sea dive? You plunge, you bounce back the fuck up, <laughs> and come back down the goddamn game. I, I have control of how deep I go in this sea. I'm in the deep sea. I got my shit on, my scuba gear. I got my life vest. Do you know how long they be down there? A long time, dude. I, I, That's a long time for shit to go wrong. Hey. My deep sea trip is not timed. I don't understand why you're trying to put me up in the water. We got enough for five minutes. You can't get that deep in five minutes? Fuck it. <laughs> it's well, it's not the aspect of going down deep, is it? Or is it just being out in the it's deep wide minute. sea? Okay, there, okay. for example, there's snorkeling. Snorkeling, you don't really go that deep. You can still see the surface. That's what we're talking about, right? No, we're talking about deep sea diving. But deep. What is... Okay, say you're in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. Aren't you at the deep sea? <laughs> Without going yeah, down, like, are you located in the deep, deep sea? sea? <laughs> you in the deep sea, so you deep sea diving. No matter how far you go down, you just okay. You, you know, it's fine. You want to deep sea dive, risk your life. I'll just jump real quick. Okay. Oh, you? What you say? Hmm? Why? Because it's quick. Just jump. And but what dive. about the bounce back? That's fine. That's still probably like what a five minute jump. Of, since like, I said, bouncing? since I said bounce back, I thought about Big Sean. <laughs> uh, shoo! I'm dyslexic, so <laughs> I'm just gonna. Figure, I forgot to throw that out there. That's a disclaimer. <laughs> it's not like I'm using it as a crutch. I'm just saying, like sometimes some sh- other shit happens. It's not my fault. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm gonna make myself fuck up now. I'm sorry. Uh, shit. Would you rather spend twenty years in prison? And be exonerated as innocent or be put away for four years despite your innocence and be considered guilty forever. Woo, that's a good one. Get on. Oh, shit. Go ahead. Shit like that depends on the crime, though. Because, like, it depends on the crime. Because it's like, oh, what I read? Yeah. It says, okay. Let's read it again to make sure. I got some. Highlight it. Okay, would you rather spend 20 years in prison and be exonerated as innocent or be put away for four years despite your innocence and be considered guilty forever? Yeah, it depends on the crime. She said she had to slick read that shit over because I'm dyslexic. <laughs> Y'all don't think I got it. I got it. You, you sneaky motherfucker, boy. I'm making sure we both understand. They stab you in the back, <laughs> huh? Okay. Okay, yeah, that depends. Because if it's like some shit like murder, okay, fine, whatever. Y'all can call me a murderer. But if it's like pedophilia or something like that, no. I'm not going to so be considered think, a pedophile for the rest of my life. So you think pedophiles are worse than murderers? Yes. Personally. Okay. What you don't? I think it's the same shit. <laughs> like, I mean, depending on like if it's justified on the murder part. Because murder is murder, you know, regardless if it's yeah. like self-defense or not you still murder somebody at the end of the day so like in that aspect 
a kid can't just say, I mean, in I guess normal society nowadays, a kid can't just say like, hey, I love this 30 year old man as a 15 year old. Cause you don't, you don't have that uh, adult, uh, a mind or some shit like that. I wasn't even thinking 15. I was thinking like younger than that. Because it honestly, to be completely honest, when I think of pedophile, I think of like little, little kids. Like eight? Yes. Okay, 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 okay. I feel you. I feel you Which it's mind. still like if you're 15 and it's like 30 year old, it's still pedophilia, but my mind automatically goes to like little, little kids. And to be honest, most people know a murderer in their life and they're chill with it. You don't want to know a pedophile <laughs> in no case. Honestly. More people know more pedophile. Well, you know the pe- you know the person, but you won't know the pedophile. Exactly. Like I, I, we should go on that little little. I think it's called like Watchdog. If y'all ever, if y'all ever want to know like if you have pedophiles in your area, I think it's a website called Watch. I'm, I'll put it in my description once I find it. I think it's called Watchdog. You can go in there and it does like a location search, mm-hmm. like a GPS or whatever, and shows you all the people who has uh se- sexual. Deviancy, deviant charges. Yeah, uh, sex, uh, sex offenders. Sex offenders. Sex They're offenders. The simplest way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, 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 I yeah, looked yeah, that yeah. shit up. I have a two year old, about to be three. I looked it up for this neighborhood. I was freaked the fuck out. There are so many that's close by. <laughs> what? Hi, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> What's the nigga from uh, Family Guy? Are you talking about the old man? Yeah. I was about to say the deaf man. He's not a pedophile. The old mm-hmm. man. Herbert. Herbert. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you want to pick a question? Oh. Uh, did you answer it? Fuck oh, it. Oh, we went on a tangent. We did. I'd rather just spend 20 years in prison than be exonerated. Because I honestly feel like it's that it would be for like Fucked up shit. Yeah. What was your answer? Shit, give me a four. <laughs> Cause what you call me, huh? I'm free, huh? Four years? You really don't care. I give a fuck. Cause like, <laughs> depend. Look, 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 look. Despite your innocence, you innocent. Four years. I actually, heard, I actually heard me read the question. I said you heard me. I don't know, dude. You heard me. It's some shit I'm not for. You heard me. Ask. You feel me? Shut up. <laughs> you heard me. Okay, that's what I'm saying. Like, despite your innocence. Ooh, that's a good one. You get me? Mm-hmm. You're exonerated as innocent, but you did the shit. No. That's what I say. Look, <clears throat> would you rather spend 20 years in prison and be exonerated as innocent or be put away for four years despite your innocence? Despite your innocence. Despite your So you're innocence. saying, God damn. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck out of that note. Wait, so this first one. You're saying that you may, you still may or may not be innocent. It says, "Would you rather spend 20 years in prison and be exonerated as innocent? You will be exonerated. Like say, how, but you can still be guilty. Yeah, say how like uh, I hate to do this. Say how Kodak Black and Donald Trump. See how you got uh, he got exonerated of all his charges or whatever, but like he was already guilty. Mm-hmm. Same thing with Lil Wayne. Lil Wayne had he pleaded guilty to his gun charge so he can get exonerated by Trump. Mm. So you have to be guilty to be exonerated. I mean, you don't have to be guilty to be exonerated. Like, I mean, you have to be in, uh, you have to be in prison. Obviously. Exactly. And you have to yeah. be going through your, the court process. Yeah. You, you have to be sentenced. Yeah. But I was about to say like, uh, what, what's I'm not case? saying that you gotta be like guilty as in you really did that crime, yeah. but you're in prison for yeah. that crime. <laughs> yeah, I get it. I, I just keep thinking the four year one. I also would like to say, fuck my laptop. <laughs> Why the fuck does this shit do this? This doesn't make no fucking sense. This is crazy. This is stupid. Why don't you close it? Just... I don't kind of like it. <laughs> <laughs> Talking shit. All right. Here we go. I had my question. Where is it? Would you rather mentally or physically never age? Number 96? Mm hmm. Would you rather mentally or physically never age? Physically. 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 <laughs> physically. Oh, my money never to get old. Uh, yeah, definitely physically. Yeah, I definitely agree. Like, what what they mean by mentally ill? It's like Alzheimer's? That's not Alzheimer's. Like, say at this age right now. Dementia? No. <laughs> like, 
You're talking about shit where you forget shit. I'm talking I mean, about- that's what what aging mentally would be. Because I, I mean, if you think about it in the aspect of getting old in your body, your body deteriorates and get old and shit. Mm-hmm. So when your mind get old, not 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 in the aspect of oh, I learned so much wisdom and you know what I mean. No, just like your mind. It's getting old, so like your mind is deteriorating, and like dementia is like the deterioration of your mind, right? Or some shit like that. I mean, I mean, yeah, it is a deterioration of your mind if you're looking at it that way. But I'm sorry if it's been like we got you know dementia or uh, Alzheimer's. Didn't you say you one of your can, family members had it? My granddad has uh, dementia right now, and my grandma passed away from um, dementia. Uh, well, she when she passed away, she had dementia, but deep cut. Another story. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. But uh, I think it's like, uh, what is it? How you say it? Fucking Alzheimer's can be dementia, but dementia can't be Alzheimer's. So yeah. like, the Alzheimer's is under the the umbrella of dementia. Google it. Okay. I was thinking more so like, <laughs> <laughs> like I put myself back to when I was like eighteen, and if I just never aged. From there, like I still had eighteen-year-old Lisa's mindset, you know. I know, but that's not. I don't think that's what it is. That's what I took it as. Either way, I choose physically. Okay. Yeah. I choose physically too. Yeah. But for the opposite reason first. We think it, we get into the same answer. I'm just saying we get into the same saying, answer. Why but you different. had to specify the opposite reason at first? Shit is true. No uh-huh. <laughs> reason is bad. No, 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 no. Just don't think of it that way. It just you know. Just see it differently. Tomato, potato. <laughs> Uh, ooh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. <sighs> Would you rather have a family of 12 children or never be able to have children at all? I swear to God, I am dyslexic. It just, it is, it's, it's fun. I don't know if that's not blunt. I hit earlier of that fucking habitual tea you just gave me. Woo! <laughs> that's easy for you to answer. Why you say that? Because you don't have to birth them. I actually have to birth my 12 children. You have to provide for them hoes. I mean, I mean, even if it's 50 50, you still have, who the fuck want to provide for six? My thing is, I would probably <laughs> die on like kid 12. Nah. I don't think my body could push out 12 kids. It barely was able to push out one. Okay. <laughs> I wanted that. Y'all can always, you can always use that. Yeah, to be honest, I think I'd rather just not have kids if I have to push out 12 of them. I feel you. Mm-hmm. I feel you. You got to catch them up. I spit all over my fucking screen. I know you did. <laughs> Wait, so what's your answer? Um. Oh yeah, I definitely take that twelve. You take the twelve. I take the twelve. I take the twelve. That's a lot. I mean, if you think about it, it's an investment. Out of twelve, at least, at least two gonna be set off right. You know what I'm saying? You only gotta deal with that for about. 18, 25 years. Come on, man. Roll the dice. I mean, I'm not going to lie. My grandma had 10, and about half of them did well. Other half still at home. Hey, man. You got to got a motherfucker panning, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to have me. I'm going to strive for at least lab level. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, you all right. You, you don't have to. Uh, it's your go, right? Yeah. I already know the one you're looking at. <laughs> I know the Do one you looking at. Yep. <laughs> Would you rather be four foot five or mm-hmm. seven foot seven? <laughs> I mean, four, as a little person, four foot five isn't far off from my height. Exactly, as a little person. Yeah. So to be honest, yeah, I'll just go down a little bit. Four foot five. I'm four foot eleven. I don't know if I can say this. What? Okay. If I I'm, I'm five eight right now. So right now. Right now. You never know. I might have a growth spurt. It's still possible. I'm, I'm gonna say something stupid too. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> yeah. Can you be trans height? Like trans sizal? That's what they would call it. Huh? I can believe I believe that I'm seven seven in my heart. <laughs> in my heart, I am a seven seven man. No, not really. I'm part of the job. I'm sorry. I love y'all. I mean, technically though, you could. Cause but, you can get like knee surgery. That's what I'm saying. So, but okay. My other question that was pretty dumb. <laughs> <clears throat> well, height take away from dick because I um don't feel like. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I don't feel like um it might be worth it. <laughs> At the end of the day, dude. <laughs> I, I, okay, think about it as just an aspect. Think about it. Okay. So they say if you gain weight, you lose an inch of it. Yes. And if you lose, I think 10, 20 pounds, 50 pounds, 20 to 50 pounds, you're supposed to gain of inch of dick and uh-huh. also you have three inches of hidden dick behind your penis i found that out from uh oprah oprah taught you that hey oprah <laughs> yeah dr oz is on the episode oh okay so dr oz taught you that oprah hosted it i want to sound like i'm like high challenge though i mean not high challenge but like what is it insecure about my height because i would definitely be just five eight for the rest of my life my thing is realistically, what man would want to be four foot five if he had? That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Like I'm not insecure about my height in any fucking way, but if I was four or five, I might start being. Cause the pool, mm-hmm. the pool is so shallow at that depth. Granted, though, seven foot seven, you gonna have a lot of health problems: back pain, knee pain, whatever other pain. Don't people that height be dying early too? Yeah, for bone uh, mm-hmm. issues, they have like. Low bone density or some shit like so that. So would you rather be insecure or be in pain? Pain. Pain. Yeah. <laughs> Beauty is pain. I mean, yeah. Is it weird that I look in the camera when I say shit? Somebody's got to look in the camera. <laughs> it's not damn sure. Nah, I've just been looking at you this whole time. Oh. Uh, let's see. Would you like... Uh, there to go. <laughs> Y'all saw it first hand. <laughs> All right, I might skip that one. Which one? <laughs> Shit, the one I fucked up on. <laughs> number one. I can't remember. I fucked up on that bitch okay. bad. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Would you rather travel the U.S. and see the sights in in a motorhome or by plane? Easy motorhome. Definitely motorhome. Really? Fuck yeah. Oh, you've been on a plane, so I yeah, thought you. Yeah, it's not see. Same answer. <laughs> Got there a different way. I love planes. It was amazing. Fuck spirit. But I love spirit planes. Really Spirit's fucking horrible. I hate spirit. Damn. Oh my god. The most rudest attitude of little bitches it is out there. Spirit. So they're like the McDonald's of planes? They're like... I don't know. McDonald's is a, a major plus on the ass. They're like... If anybody ever rode a mega bus, it's like a mega bus in the air. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, yeah, but it's shaped like a fucking Greyhound bus. Listen, you know how you have, <clears throat> you know how a normal, a normal government, re- what is it, regulated plane has a business class. <laughs> you got a, uh, uh, what the other one is? Uh, what first class? First class. Listen, this one in the back though, in the middle of business. Econ- you got economy. Mm. Business class, first class, spirit, you all in the same fucking cabin. It's only the only thing separating you and the pilot is motherfucking not even the door. This shit is like it's like you're sitting in a fucking helicopter. That's right? fucking scary. It's weird. And then <laughs> you can see all the fucking boats in the side of the plane. Like <laughs> it's like you're in a fucking army fighter jet or something. Like you finna jump out that I don't know. Fuck spirit, man. <laughs> So is that like want to do a motorhome? Nah, I just want to with a motorhome. I just want to, uh, you know, see the sights and shit like that. It'd be easier. Like I, I drove from Florida to California, as you know, and it was just nice. Yeah, it was super nice. It took like thirty four hours. Got there and I flew back the next day, but it still was nice. The plane ride was only six hours. Mm. So you don't really get to enjoy much, Mm-mm. and plus you'd be scared pretty long. Like, plane rides are for when you're trying to get there. And do some whole shit. Okay. Next question. <laughs> Let me try to pick a good one since it's going to be the last one. You know what? Number one, comma. Would you rather go into the past and meet your ancestors or go into the future and meet your great, great grandchildren? Why in the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Where I want to go. <laughs> I'm not going to say, because I feel like people want me to say, nah, I'm definitely going to the future. I'm not even going to say why. This is fucked up. I love my people. I would be my ancestors. Why? 
You gonna help him, Harriet? Huh? I wasn't going that far back. Oh, <laughs> oh, you're gonna be in the house. That's what you say. You're gonna be in the air conditioner. Bruh. You're gonna be right by the ice. <laughs> huh? That's a oh, okay. All right. No, I Brynhilda. I <laughs> I just want to meet my grandmother. My grandmother on my mom's side died when she was like five. So I didn't get to meet her. She's an ancestor. She's an ancestor. That's not what they're talking about. Yes, they are. They're not. Yes. Okay, 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 okay. They so what they, uh, 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 they did with the... the, the you can't read this book. <laughs> they did with the end of the question. You got to put all it together. Or go into the future and meet your great-great-grandchildren. You feel me? Still with me, my ancestors. Because I feel I, like my great great grandchildren, the way the direction the world is going in, I feel like my great great grandchildren just piss me the fuck off. Or. I'm just being on some stupid shit. That's, that, you got an old man mindset. I do. Listen. And I'm okay with that. I'll meet Look my at ancestors. technology right, motherfucking man. Huh? My great great grandkids get done, we ain't gonna be fine shit. Huh? Normally. I almost put the shit down the floor. <laughs> but. Where you going? <laughs> Fuck it. Antarctica, bitch. You coming? Happily. Yeah. What the? Why? Right. Right. You want to go back to horse and buggy? Huh? Huh? I want to meet the people. Matter of fact, I seen the question. I no, that was on somewhere else. What? It said somebody. Would you rather be whipped or? And that is all. Hey, <laughs> I'm <laughs> I am Dave, and this is Elisa. What's it again? Elisa Vetta. I'm not going to get it right to the next episode. Lisa. You too. I'll tag her in. You can go on my uh, actual channel and she's in my ninja squad, my ninja homies, my ninja, my YouTube ninjas, my ninjas on YouTube and my channels. She's there. Um, we're going to put another video up on her page because she has shit there. Um, anything to say? No. You thought I was going to just cut you off, didn't you? <laughs> Thanks for watching. Mm-hmm. <laughs>